In yet another display of Totorina acting on impulse comes the story of the Giamonas. On January 28, 1995, 23-year-old Giuseppe Giamona was behind the counter of his clothing store on Via Bentevenia in Sicily. He was speaking with his girlfriend at the time when Enzo Brusca and Vito Vitali walked into the store, pushed the girl to the ground, and shot Giuseppe to death. The reason for his murder was Totorina, who was in prison at the time, received word that the opposition mafia clans in Sicily were looking to kidnap his older son, Giovanni. This information came to light after Giovanni Brusca, Enzo's brother, began cooperating. One month after her brother's murder, Giovanna Giamona and her husband Francesco Saparito was traveling in the car with their two small children down a street in Corleone. The family was headed to dinner when their car suddenly was boxed in. Two shooters appeared, who happened to be, again, Vito Vitali and Leo Luca Bagarella, who was Totorina's brother-in-law, and they began firing into the car. Giovanna and Francesca were both hit four times and lost their lives, and amazingly, the children were not injured or covered in the blood of their parents. Although Giovanna's husband Francesco had family ties to the mafia, he himself was not involved. And the Giamona family had nothing to do with the mafia. What's worse is the Giamonas were distant cousins to both Giacomo Riina, Toto's uncle, and Toto himself. But none of that mattered to him. 